Majan, yes. let me ask you, because you said it's very different this time, and you have been speaking to young people in Iran yes. from where you are in Paris. What are they saying to you? Absolutely. Boys and girls, Absolutely. what are they saying to you? What they... What they say to me is that, the, is that they don't want the system anymore. They want democracy. I mean, they don't believe in the reform and their right. Iran's government is a dictatorship. Uh, if a dictatorship opens for reform, for being transformed, it stops being a di dictatorship. Reform and dictatorship doesn't go together. So this is something not possible. You cannot make this government to become a democratic government because it's, it is not it is in its spaces is a dictatorship and they want a new a new they, they want a new government they want a new regime they want a new system and I talk to them and this generation they're very very different from us I mean we have to know that you know the time that the Islamic revolution happened only 40 percent of Iranian people they could read and write now it's above 80 percent of them these people they have they're born with it internet they have they have access actually to the information around the world. This new generation, first of all, they claim not to be sexist at all. You see, I mean, the big slogan is Zan Zendegi Azadi, woman, life, freedom. And the human rights, I mean, the women's rights is the human right. In any society, Iran or anywhere else in the world, if the women are repressed, if half of the population, they are actually worth half of the other half just because of the, the, their gender, we cannot talk about mm -hmm. democracy and human rights. Women's rights and human rights is the same thing. And this is something that they have understood. So that gives lots of hope because I always thought and I always believed that the biggest enemy of democracy is the patriar patriarchal culture. Yet these young boys, this young... Uh, I, I spoke actually with one today, and he was like, of course, we are equal to, to, to the girls. Of course, there is no difference. And uh, this generation, you cannot fool them like they fooled our generation. Mm -hmm. And Iranian people in general, they're much more secular than 40 years ago. And this is exactly the basis of the problem. You have a government which is not absolutely in touch with its population. It doesn't know what the population wants. They think they are the majority. They have a basis for sure. But this is not the majority of the country. If the majority of the country was with the government, it would not be called a dictatorship again. And uh, yes, so, so knowing all of that, if a government is not in touch with the, its population, that it cannot govern them because you have to know your people.